Hey guys, so if you've been following ForgottenWeapons.com, the blog, you know that uh, we were playing around in the recent Rock Island auction, and we finally got our shipment of goodies in. So I figured I'd do a quick video here. I want to actually use this opportunity to apologize, I think, to everybody I have ever mailed a rifle to, because I have never packed a rifle like these things are packed. And uh, we'll take the opportunity to show you just how Rock Island packages guns. So, of course, I have this box to begin with, and this has two rifles in it. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up, and then we'll take a look at what's inside it. All right, so inside the first box, we have two more boxes. Let's go ahead and pull those out. Alright, so now we have another box. This is actually a cover. Over box number three. All right, so inside this box, we have a whole mess of styrofoam peanuts. We have the bolt packaged separately. I think I could probably drop this thing from the FedEx airliner and it would not sustain any damage because see if you can see this. So here is the inside of the next box. We have this rifle wrapped up like a mummy in bubble wrap, covered in plastic sheet wrap. We have this plastic saran wrap. Okay, now I've got the saran wrap off. Now, The rifle has been wrapped, muzzled to stock, in like four layers of bubble wrap. And then, even under that, they've gone and wrapped the butt, the muzzle, and the highest point, generally the rear sight, in yet more bubble wrap. So let's take that off. is my awesome new Ross rifle. Of course, I have to pull the bolt out as well. Huh. Interestingly, this particular Ross bolt has not been safety riveted. Of course, if you uh, watch my previous video on blowing up a Ross, you'll know exactly how to look for that. There we go. So, You'll be seeing more of this particular Ross. This is a Mark 3B used by the, uh, the British, and I will not be blowing it up, but I will be having some fun with it, and we'll be getting some video. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching, guys. I uh, would like to just give a shout out to Rock Island Auctions. They've got some really cool stuff, and man, do they package it well. So thanks, guys, and uh, tune in again to ForgottenWeapons.com.